Colin and I have a hate-hate relationship, especially Mulberry. We just do not like each other at all, right? We have high readings for Mulberry, Ash, and now Juniper saying, hey, I'm going to jump in the mix, too. So that's what we're seeing outside right now. Air quality in the moderate category has been good lately, but the reason why we're seeing moderate readings is because the winds have kicked up, and it's blown around a little bit of dust, and it's blown around these guys, too, all right? It's just that time of the year. Current temperatures outside, 79 in Centennial Hills, Summerlin, 74 for you, 81 downtown in North Las Vegas. Nice. 78 for Sunrise Manor. Same goes for Green Valley and uh, Whitney Ranch. 80 in Henderson, 75 Rhodes Ranch, Mountain's Edge, and Southern Highlands. Seven Hills, currently 79 degrees in the Lakes at 74. Nice and mild, too, also for Prump at 76, 77 in Mesquite, 83 in Laughlin. You heard Madison. She said it's great outside. Feels great out there for a live shot. I don't blame her. It's nice outside. 84 in Death Valley. So warmer for you out in Inyo County. Uh, clear skies, at least mainly clear skies for us right now because there are clouds to the north. We took out the satellite because we just wanted to show you the radar and show you how dry it is. Is, but there's still moisture and rainfall in San Joaquin Valley changing over to snow in the Sierras. If we could just get some of this to move over to us, that'd be great. But unfortunately, that's all going to stay there. The low way off on the Pacific Northwest, but this is what we call the trough, this big dip here in the jet stream. And this will be swinging through tonight and also into next week. So as this pushes through, we'll see some other systems sort of uh, dive down the backside of this that we'll see early on next week. So we have several days and several opportunities for wind, and that includes tomorrow too. Gusty winds for tomorrow, Sunday breezy, Monday a little bit of a lull, and then the next one moves in on Tuesday and Wednesday, giving us more wind and breezy winds later on in the week. We call it the spring wind, so it's just that time of the year. As far as tomorrow goes, yes, it will be another gusty day, especially midday this time. And beyond, and then we'll see those winds decrease a little more tomorrow night. So that's your forecast for tomorrow. But for tonight, prepare for those gusty winds still still be around. 58 degrees, partly cloudy skies tomorrow. 71, windy and cooler, but it'll be sunny. Those gusts up to uh, 35 for tomorrow. Meanwhile, your eight on the eight forecast does show, like we said, several days of wind. Temperatures will drop to the 60s on Sunday, but we'll be back to those 70s Wednesday. However. Look at that. They'll stay in the mid to low 70s into late next week, too. I'll take it. That's your most accurate forecast. We'll see you guys at 9. Christian, over to you.